Hey, in this video, uh, it's a short um, addition to the prior video. So we're using uh, NGUI. Uh, this one's as of uh, April 2nd, uh, 2015, version 3.8.2. Yeah, here I've also added the, um, uh, the mobile extras in GUI. So I have the scene loaded up. This is the mobile demo scene, um, the NGUI one, which is right there. Uh, so the first thing I did is under under the um, NGUI Open Atlas Maker, I added um, my GUI texture to the atlas, and I added uh, the gun icon that I'm using, which I believe is this one, uh, to the atlas. I just did add update. Uh, so the same thing, I did the scene objects, I threw everything under an empty game object to get it out of the way. Um, I copied my M4A1 that I set up um, in the prior video, and I made a copy of it here for the mobile NGUI player. Um, and then the next thing I did is I uh, found the anchor center, I duplicated this crosshair, and for the sniper crosshair, Click on this and hit reset, and it's going to clear these two out. Just leave them empty. And then what you're going to do is I selected my um, GUI for the scope. Um, I turned it on, and I changed the settings to, it happened to be 750 by 750. Uh, there may be a better way to do it, but um, this way works, so I just kind of quickly did that. Uh, the weapon scroller, I mean, find the anchor top right, which is right there. Uh, expand it and go down to the weapon scroller piece. I duplicated the three machine gun and I named it uh, M4A1. It's the same exact name as this. And then for the sprites, I just uh, selected the gun sprite. I enabled it um, so that I could adjust it how I wanted, so that it, you know, I kind of stretched it out a little bit, and then I disabled it again. So for the sniper script, no change is necessary. Just reference this crosshair and reference the sniper crosshair, and make sure this sniper one is disabled. Uh, you may want to change some of these settings, like the tracking speed. Um, you can make this uh, lock-on radius maybe five, and track radius maybe four. Um, that way, it make it a little easier to um, lock onto the target. Okay, so I picked up my sniper rifle. When I zoom in, I've got my reticle, and then if I get close to here, it snaps on and it changes red, off and on, so it works. Um, so there you go. Uh, that's the difference. Uh, one thing you may want to do is is to check the depth of all your GUI items um, because you see for my crosshair um, it actually is behind everything. Um, so you want to make sure that this is where you want it depth wise. I, I like it behind it, um, and GUI actually gives you a lot of flexibility with that. Uh, Alright, thanks a lot.